Hi, this is Mike from BookUp.com. And let's say you got a brand new chess engine for Christmas and you want to try to figure out how to switch to it. Let me show you how to do that. Whenever you have an ebook open, you want to go to the Edit menu and select Program Preferences. This window will come up and it has a number of tabs, General, Screen, Export, and the one you want is Engine. So click on the Engine tab if that's not the one highlighted. And it shows you everything that's currently set about the engine. The things we're interested in here are select engine, the engine type, whether it's Windboard or UCI. Um, if you have to guess, it's probably UCI. Almost all modern engines are made with the uh, UCI uh, protocol. And then up here we have the nicknames for the engines we're using. We can type in anything here to let us know what kind of engine we're using. Currently it's set to Ruffian for the UCI engine. And down here we can see what it's running. It's running program files, and since it's a 16, or actually a 32-bit application, it's going to be an x86. Um, if you're on a 64-bit version of Windows, you're going to have a different different program files folder here. But we'll come to that in a minute. So scroll over here to the right, and he says, okay, fine, it's Ruffian, and then probably going to be Ruffian.exe is the engine we're running. All engines used by Chester Rings Wizard end in .exe. To change an engine, click on Select Engine. Now, we're in the Ruffian folder, and if we click up here, and this will be different in different versions of Windows, but if you click here in this drop-down, we can see that we're in the Ruffian folder inside the Engines folder. So just go up one folder to Engines, click there, and I can see all the folders with all the engines in them. So there's a folder for Crafty, one for Ruffian, and one for Stockfish. Say I want to switch to Stockfish, I'll double-click the Stockfish folder. There's only one EXE file there, this one right here, Stockfish-171-32-JA. There's probably a newer version of Stockfish you could actually use and throw into this folder. So whatever your new engine is, you double-click on that, and voila, it's switched to that folder, Stockfish, and that particular engine, which always has to again, end again in EXE. No exceptions. Sometimes you'll find a UCI folder that won't, or UCI ending uh, program, that won't work. Or an ENG, that won't work either. It has to be an EXE. Once we have it switched over, we want to go to the UCI nickname, backspace over whatever is there, and type in the nickname of our engine, in this case, Stockfish. And if we knew it was 32 or something, we could type in Stockfish32. Again, whatever you type in here is up to you. We click OK, and our engine's changed. Now if we click on Start Engine, our new engine should start running. Sure enough, Stockfish32 is running. Let's move that over so you can see all the information. So if Stockfish32 is running, there's the uh, copyright line, and there's the analysis, the best line, and the second best line. So that's how to change, change a chess engine inside of Chess Openings Wizard.